think I got one, guys. It's a nice doe, it looks like. Sorry, guys, I couldn't get the shot on the camera. I didn't have time to sit down in the stand. I was just setting everything down. Look over and I see two of them. I think I got the biggest out of the two. Let's go see if we can get it. I don't know if you guys can see it on the camera, but it's right down there. It's down right there. behind that tree. First, right walking in here. Didn't get time to sit down. Right size, not as big as I wish it could have been. Would have been, but what are you gonna do? I'll take it. And it went straight down. Didn't feel a thing. Nice size though. It's a taker. My dad's off with the crossbow. This is youth hunt. And my dad's off with the crossbow. My younger cousin is off with his dad with his shotgun. Down another stand. All right. Looks like I gotta drag this thing out of here by myself then. And that's not fun dragging it up. This. <laughs> I'll figure something out. Right now, I am really jealous of my friend who's hunting West Virginia with a rifle because he's got a four-wheeler and he doesn't have to drag this thing all the way up the hill. Oh. This is the this is the part of hunting that's not as fun. Oh. Wish me luck getting this thing up. Sean got him a nice doe on the Sunday of the youth hunt here in Ohio. Good job, brother. That's a nice one. Very nice. Didn't even have a chance to sit in the stand. I was on the south end of the property sitting with the crossbow. And I heard the shot. I knew right away he got one. Let's see the point of, end of uh, placement of shot. That's the fifth P I've been trying to show you guys. Took Sean to actually give it to you. Oh, he's got him a little high yeah. in the neck. A little high in the neck, but that's all right. Your actual placement of shot would be awesome right in that heart area, heart lung area, guys. Still Very good. nice deer. Very nice deer. Good job, brother. Thanks. Good Glad job. You yeah, up. no doubt. Beautiful out here. Didn't even give me a chance to sit down and get in a spot to hunt. All right, guys. Sean's got one in the freezer for us. She's a fat one, too. Nice big fat one. Cool. Good job. Alright, guys. We're going to field dress this one, and we'll try to get that on video for you, too. Find a good spot to do it. But that is the Fifth P, guys. Placement of shot. What I'm doing here, guys, is cutting around the bunghole first. About two inches in, maybe. Two inches. 
is. It's nice to have someone to help you. I'm just going right down there and zipping her open for the first couple layers. Try not to hit the guts, guys. She's still warm. Nice shot, though. Even next shots will work. Still dropped them. She didn't run at all, did she? No. If I heard that sure. shot. I knew you got one. Nice way to start the day. Yep, hell of a way to start the day. I was worried we got here a little late. We like to be here before daylight. This knife, I should have sharpened it. What I like to do, guys, I leave the chest cavity uncut for right now because uh, I like to fill that with ice. Get through this fat layer. See how she just starts opening up. Try not to go through the guts. That's why I got the blade upwards. Just kind of zi zipper it. How are we doing on batteries? Yeah. You can see the guts right there. Just got to be real careful. This does definitely, definitely an estrus. It's easy to cut yourselves, guys, with all that air coming out. I hit a little bit of the gut there. That's all right. I can still get it out of there. Oh, that's a smell. Yeah, you can smell it. It's all right. We still got it whole. What we're looking for back in here, guys, looks like meat. There's your... You want to cut through that diaphragm down in here, and then it will release all that. And be careful you don't cut yourself. That was a long... Get through that diaphragm, and this will all release after you cut more of the around the rectum and all that. It looks like a big old piece of meat there, but it's not. See how it's all just coming out. Everything is starting to come out. I gotta do the same thing to the other side. It's a little gory, guys, but I like to do it on a hill too. See how that big meat there look? It looks that's the diaphragm we're trying to cut to right here. It's easy, easy to cut yourselves. There's the heart. A little bit more right there. She's a stinky one. He has full stomach. Yeah, definitely. Got the heart right in my hand. Okay, there's all the guts, everything, guys. Now, you all right? Want to grab that lady inside? Yeah. Let's go ahead and spread that top up. That just releases that. I do things a little unconventional, but it works and you don't get no guts. There's your heart, guys, right there. Part of the esophagus, your lungs. All vital. All vitals. Well, this all just start releasing. A lot of blood. You 
you can see guys, um, you know, this ain't the cleanest version of it, but all that. This one's out of the way? Yeah. All that's the guts, guys, and I'm going to go ahead and get over here and cut this too. All right, guys, the whole idea is just to pull all these guts and entrails right out so nothing gets in your meat. I didn't cut around this part good enough, which we're getting right now. Got to be careful here because you can hit that rectum and get scat all over your meat. Usually that'll pop right out for you. I know this is messy, guys, but I like part of hunting. Right. One more connection. That'll all come out. There you go. Bone hole and all, guys. Everything. All the guts. All the unwanted. And all the unwanted. And the heart. I like to leave for the uh, animals. A lot of guys will eat that. But I like to leave that for the animals so the deer can carry on with his journey. But that's all for the coyotes. You want to get a little of this extra fat out, make sure there ain't no poop or anything. That's one one fell swoop guys I know this is messy but that's part of deer hunting okay go ahead let go Sean yeah, I like this. that's why I do it on a hill drain her out man. wasn't the cleanest guys but it's done the murder <laughs> Sean got it done now that's all it counts it's bigger than I thought it was yeah walked well, up on nice his girl very nice deal meat in the, t in the freezer all right guys I'm gonna go out and see if I can get me one now can you stay tuned all right guys thanks for joining us for another episode of Whitetail Bushcraft Outfitter, Path of the Hunt led us down to Guernsey, Ohio, Quaker City. Give you guys a look at the cabin down here in Guernsey County, Quaker City. Gotta love this country, guys. Nothing but hills and foot trails. Sean did real good on morning of the youth hunt, so let's see if he can get himself another one. Fill that freezer up good. I got the crossbow with me, too. As long as I got orange on, I'm allowed to hunt too. Not with the shotgun yet. All right, guys, we're gonna go see what we can kick up. I got my nephew over on in a stand down a ways. We're gonna do a little stalking and checking out where they've been logging the area. So stay tuned.
City. Gotta be real quiet. It's about 1 30, 2 o'clock in the evening. I'm smack dab in the middle of the woods. I'm gonna give you my panoramic. I'm sitting right on the edge of a ravine here. And I got a uh, logger road that's just nothing but filled with uh, deer tracks. And I actually kicked a couple up coming down into this spot. But I'm backed up against some briars. And uh, we're going to see if we can get one. I got a beautiful view. You can see off in the distance past the woods there. Looking at the mountain. That's a squirrel. Sean's on the other side of the woods, so stay tuned guys, I'll see if I can harvest one myself. Just about out of legal hunting time, guys. I don't think my nephew's going to get one, but Sean got one. That's good job on his part. John John will have to bring him back out in the woods and try again. Once again, I want to thank you guys for joining us at Whitetail Bushcraft Outfitters. If I happen to see a deer before I run out of legal hunting time, I will turn the camera back on. Take care, guys. I'll catch you on the next video.